Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to learn how to add a background to your SharePoint site header. You can add headers to your communication sites or to team sites as well. So let's go and have a look how to actually do that. So I have another site opened and I don't have any background for this SharePoint site header. Now to add a background, you need to click on the site settings and then click on change the look and then click on header. Now under layouts, I currently have compact selected and I don't have any option to basically add an or upload an image. And that's same for the minimal and standard layout. The option for your background only comes under the extended layout option. So if you select the extended layout, you can see that that's an image um, option for you to upload an image. And obviously with the extended layout, your site navigation basically comes down, right? So let's just click on upload and uh, I'm just going to pick an image and there you go. You can change the focal points of this image to where you want to focus on that image. And once you're happy with your settings, you can click on save, right? So that's how you basically add a header. If you want to know more and learn about SharePoint, I've recently created a complete guide um, for SharePoint Online, which is basically um, on Udemy. So you can enroll on this course um, on Udemy website. I'll leave the link to this course within the description of this video uh, and with a discounted coupon as well so that you actually don't pay the full amount. You get a discount. And this um, course basically complete, it's a complete guide and you know, we walk from the basics of SharePoint and then we deep dive into the advanced level um, settings and creations of services within SharePoint. This course is, you know, it contains 22 sections and 179 um, lectures and goes over 15 hours. So you can understand this is a very comprehensive course. Um, so it doesn't matter if you already know SharePoint and want to learn more about SharePoint. It's for you. If you are a beginner, um, that's for you as well, because we are starting from the very beginning of SharePoint. Um, so that was about the course. Uh, but, you know, if you have any feedback or comments, please feel free to put those in the comment section. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.